Hey, what's up, guys? It's Jay from Sportsbook Review here with your two-minute drill. So the New England Patriots come into New Jersey this week to take on the New York Jets on Monday Night Football. And what an incredible defense that this New England Patriots team has. They have been the number one defense in football since week two without an end in sight. This is the best defense that Tom Brady has had since the days of Ty Law and Rodney Harrison, and it's not even close. But let's be honest. Tom Brady needs this defense right now. Tom Brady has looked ordinary this season. The ball's not coming off his arm as fast as it has in years past, and at age 42, Tom is finally starting to show the cracks in the armor. But nonetheless, this team is 6-0 and and in full control of the AFC. On the other sideline Monday night, we have the New York Jets. Starting quarterback Sam Darnold misses a month due to illness. Backup quarterback Luke Falk steps in, and the New York Jets season falls off a cliff. Luke Falk was awful, could not do anything. So last week, Sam Darnold comes back in for the first time since week one and puts on an absolute show. He throws for 335 yards, two touchdowns en route to the New York Jets' first victory of the year over the Dallas Cowboys. So who wins this game? I'm not really concerned about who wins this game. We're going to look at the total here. The Earlier in the year, these two teams met. The final score was 30-14 to 14, New England without the Jets scoring a single point on offense. Now that Sam Darnold's in the lineup for the New York Jets, I think we're going to see even more points in this one. The Jets should be able to put up between 17 and 20. The New England Patriots will do what they always do and score 27-31, to 31, which is going to push the number over the posted total of 43.5. So we'll go for the over Monday night. For more updates, check back with sbrpicks.com and sbrodds.com and enjoy the game.